Hey guys, what's going on? Dan Meyer here and in this short video I want to show you guys a spoon that has been working very well for catching walleyes. Uh, you know we're starting to get to the mid-winter bite now where the walleyes are really shutting down. Um, you can still catch them but it's just getting more difficult. Um, the last few days I've been out walleye fishing a lot um, and catching walleyes but it's getting a lot more difficult. I'm marking a lot of fish and you know it's a lot of them aren't biting you'll get them to come right up to the bait and they just won't take it so I'm going to sh show you one spoon right now that has been working uh, you still have to really finesse them but you can get some bites and actually let me know in the comment section if you've been out walleye fishing lately if you're starting to experience the kind of the midwinter bite where you're marking a lot of fish but it's hard to get them to bite and if you have been out there this spoon will help. It's not going to solve the problem, but it's going to help. And that's this Northland Buckshot Flutter Spoon. This spoon is seeming to get more bites than some of the other ones right now. At least that's what I've uh, seen and what I've heard from some other guys in my area. It's got a real good fluttering action and it's got uh, some beads in a glass case which really helps to attract fish in from a distance. This is the uh, Super Glow Red Goldfish color. I like that because it's uh, th there's a lot of blood worms and when I'm fishing uh, deep mud flats, this is kind of matching the natural forage. Uh, I'm definitely tipping the hooks with a minnow head right now, but this, this spoon has been doing pretty good. I'm gonna leave a link in the description of this video where you can get this spoon, but when you're getting to this midwinter bite, don't expect to go out there and catch every fish you mark. It's going to be a numbers game now. You're going to mark a lot of fish that just won't bite. It's just that's what happens this time of year. You can still catch them. just gets more difficult. This spoon seems to be getting the job done as of late. But um, let me know if, you, if you've got a bait that's working real well because this time of year it can be hard to get a bite. So I'd be interested to see if you guys are getting anything. Leave me a... Uh, comment saying what you know what baits working for you this bait's been working good for me again that's the Northland uh, buckshot flutter spoon now they also have another spoon that is like this it's called the glow shot and instead of having the rattles right there they've got a uh, a little glow stick that you can put in there and it'll hold a charge up to eight hours so you don't with with a bait like this you have to reel it up hit it with a flashlight to recharge it. The glow shot, you can just put um, a little glow stick in there and that'll last for up to eight hours. Personally, I would rather recharge it because what happens is uh, I run out of the, the case they give you, I think it's three, and then after that, I you know I just don't get around to go to buy more. So, you know then I, I'm not using the bait so it's more useful to me to just buy the flutter spoon um, that you just the, the back side glows the front side doesn't so you just have to reel it up charge that back and uh, it's good to go so that's kind of what's working for me I hope this video helped if it did hit the like button also if this is your first time here I'd love to have you subscribe to my youtube channel I do videos just like this to help you catch more and bigger fish so like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.